welcome everybody to another episode of Star Sector. I need to make sure that my mic is at the right distance. I think that's okay. <laughs> right, let's continue. So, last episode, if we uh, we found a black hole, nearly got sucked into the black hole, but we got out of the black hole. We also found a really nice planet, a class 5 planet, which was quite cool. And we also got an eradicate. I think that's how you say it. Hold on, let's have a look. Uh, yeah, an eradicator. Thor. Thor the eradicator. <laughs> uh, but I've just got on my other screen, I have got your guys' comments up. And uh, who was it? Uh, where is it? They said that putting a aggressive pilot in the eradicator might not be a good move. I'll pop it up on screen. But uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to pilot this and I'm going to put mm, our personality aggressive. Okay, steady. Maybe I'll put the aggressive in here. Put you in here. Sure. <laughs> Let's see if you can blow that up. Uh, oh, cool. You just popped over. Sweet. Uh, right. I can change that, can't I? Oh, he's aggressive as well. Okay, I can change. I can change. Can I change? I can change their uh, their aggressiveness, can't I? So, mentor story points, influencing their personalities. Yeah, so you can mentor them and stuff like. That. I don't want to do that at the moment. But we have got our eagle, which is quite cool. We have got our new little dude, and. I think I'll give that a go with the with the layout that I've got now. There is a couple of uh, comments about different layouts and like uh, safety overrides and stuff like that. But what I'll do offline, I will play around with it and uh, in the simulator, see which one I like best. And I may do that myself. What was I going to do? I was going to put these guys in here, wasn't I? No, we'll just leave that in there. Yeah, because she's got a whole lot of ballistic mastery and all that kind of stuff. She's going to be better in there. Good work, Lady Lana, Commander, whatever your name is. Okay, <clears throat> let's think about what we're going to do today. So today we are going to have a look at maybe a bounty. Let's have a look, see what the bounties are. We have got this person, the hegemony with the onslaught battle and then a couple of those and then a couple of those and a couple of those. Or we've got little dude here. Or that's pretty much it. Is that the only bounties, really? Oh, huh, interesting. Okay. Or we've got the Luddock path, which we potentially could go uh, establish a base in the system. Not yet discovered. We could potentially go and find out where they are, but that's where the hegemony person is. So we can always go and have a look. Like, to be honest, we can always go and try and attack her. All we do is restart. I just don't save and we'll save back here. So yeah. uh, our other one is that we could go and uh, where is my, where's my planet? Oh, there we go. So the planets, let's go class. So this is a class five. Oh, I found two. Oh, wait, no, no, that's already done by the hegemony. This one here. So this one was the class five planet that I found all the way out on the other side of the system. It has 125% hazard rating, which apparently is good that I found out is under 150 you want is good. Right. This one has vast ruins. So I'm happy about that as well. Poor farmland though. So it's minus food production. And then somebody said here, where did they say? I, something about food, food. Where, hold on. Let me just scroll down on the thingy. Uh, I try and bounty hunt. Yep, no, that's cool. And where's the other one? Where's the other one? Oh no, I've lost it. Uh, if my planets are doing well. Uh, oh, there. I colonize a good farm planet first. After the first planet, I don't really care too much about what the other ones are. So this is this is a poor farmlands, but it has plentiful organics, which is cool. So a plus two and then cold is only uh, yeah, yeah, cold. You can just put a jumper on. It's fine. And then becomes uh, so you can minus 25 it as well as there is no stable ruling policy policy here. Civilization has collapsed and current poli um, 
population is effectively unknown. Uh, those groups of survivors, bandits, and looters can be detected. Oh, okay. So that means there's somebody technically already on there. So our other option is, how do we go? No, I wanted to go to the planet list. Is we go to types and we say, hey, where is a farmland one? What's the thing that I'm saying? It's no atmosphere. Uh, mineral deposits. Yeah. Maybe we go and have a look. Like maybe, maybe we just go and like drop all our people. We go on the fastest ship possible and we just go around and we survey things. Maybe maybe we do that today. And then we can find our planet that we may want to colonize. Uh, no atmosphere. Yeah, maybe, maybe we do that. Let's drop everybody at Larry. Uh, that's not what I wanted. Fleet, let's drop. Who are we going to go with? Well, let's drop you. And let's drop you, 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 you. Let's keep these guys here because that's that's pretty much. So let's let's keep this fleet here. How much is that per day? That's a lot per day. Oh, it's you that's costing a lot. Mm -hmm. Okay, and because you guys are getting up to hundred percent, maybe. Yeah, repairs. Is that yeah cool? And then petrol wise, they are costing only 13 fuel a day. So potentially could do this and I might put myself in this one instead of the aggressive pilot. And yeah, and we've, we've kind of got a little bit of backup with these two, which is, which is fine. We could have a max burn level of 16, not 20, which is all good. And we are going to, Oz, we're going to head out into the sectors. How do I tell if I've been there before? Oh, by hovering over them. Oh, I see. Okay, so we want to go to yellow stars. So that one, that one, and that one. Maybe we have a look at this cluster here. Uh, this says unexplored, 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 and survey, unsurveyed for. So I've obviously been there before, but I haven't surveyed any planets. So what we're going to do, we're going to go to here, and we're going to have a play around with surveying so let's head out apparently very slowly and we will go and have a look all right message you when i get there well, message you when i get there i'm not going to message you guys i'll let you know when i get there okay all right we're at our first yellow sun let's have a look see what's in here we have got cryo volcanic world we have got a gas giant and a desert world we've also got a volcanic world there as well I think this is what this does. Yep, let's do that. And unsurveyed, unsurveyed, unsurveyed. So we just have a look at that one. So it's preliminary, like, preliminary look. So activity, extreme cold, poor light. All right, not you, apparently. Let's jump into the other side, which is over here next to this planet's thing and we'll do the same thing does that cost anything it does not okay so let's do that lovely let's go to this one it says unsurveyed okay so this one oh wait oh cryo no desert world what happened what happened it didn't work Oh, there we go. Uh, so this one here just took a little bit. Let's go tab. This one here is hot, stream weather, habitable though. So that one may be a looker. It's hot though. Hazard rating, but it's only 125%. So let's have a look and we will perform a survey. What have you got? Poor farmland. Great. <laughs> I've already got a class five with poor farmland. Okay, so let's go over here and just do our skinny, skinny me bob thing. Perfect. And the cryo one has extreme heat. Oh, that bad boy is 275. No, we're not doing that. All right, let's go out of here. We'll go to the next yellow star system. Why are we going so slow? Go faster. 
and we shall see they're all in a little cluster so i won't like speed it up or anything it was just getting here that was a pain and we shall go to let's go to this one here we'll do the white dwarf last so let's go here and let's have a look so what have we got we have got a barren world or a volcanic world that's pretty much it probably a horrible system to uh colonize in but we will go and have a look excuse me sir i who are you are you oh all right this is gonna get interesting let's pop these three out deploy probably didn't need to do all three of them but let's have a look this must be my the bounty that i said was like weak oh oh <laughs> i know that was a tiny ship but oh look at that that thing's awesome what are you doing oh you're going after that okay you're just gonna just fire which is great by the way oh yeah you're cool yep sweet all right let's speed that up <laughs> you didn't destroy that one excuse me excuse me you didn't destroy that person just want to let you know cool and I want you to kill that one. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Kill him. You have got to be kidding me. Okay, cool. <laughs> what about this one? You are kiting it around like a very slow, slow ship. Nope. You, you got it. Okay. I'm, I'm sorry. I doubted you. I'm sorry. Consider ship recovery. No. Pick through the wreckage. Sure. Uh, right, let's, let's go to this one and then perform a survey. What has that got on the moment? This irradiated? It's already bad. Okay, let's leave that one. Let's go to that one like I was going to. We got 40,000, which is pretty good. I am running out of money. That's all right. Uh, no atmosphere and hot. Okay, that's even worse uh right let's not go to that one so we'll go out of the system again and cool let's jump to this system here and we'll see how we go that way yes no yes okay cool so we're gonna jump in here and we are going to say cool what's here We've got a volcanic world, we've got a cryo-volcanic world, and that is it. Oh, and a barren world. Let's have a look at the barren world. I don't have high hopes for a barren world having nice farmland. But you never know. Perform a survey. There's a signal. Order the data called retrieve. Oh, it's for the, the Galactic Academy. That's right. Um, Take the call. Cool. Perform the survey. What has this currently got? It's hot. It's 200% uh, low gravity and no atmosphere. Yeah, probably not the best idea. Uh, let's get out of here and let... Hey. Yep. Let's get out of here and we will see where the next one is. Somebody said to me, try yellow yellow stars, but maybe, maybe not. Maybe... Oh, I don't know. Oh, no, not yellow stars. Orange stars. My bad. Okay, over here. Let's go and have a look. All right, let you know when I get there. Okay, we are here. So there's quite a few orange stars here. There's one, two, three, four of them. I have been to none of them. And there's also a red dwarf and another red dwarf there. So we'll have a quick look. And we will see what is here. I think this is a dual sun world. Correct. Okay, there is an orbital dock station here and a tundra world. Oh, <gasps> that means good, eh? That means good. I'm pretty sure that means good. Yes. Ooh. Okay. Wait. Whoa. That's that's new. Okay. A brittle cold surface of Sentinel roll. Blah, 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 blah. The brittle cold surface of Sentinel rolls beneath you. The poles locked in endless winter. Hmm, kind of reminds me of Earth. Uh, only 
luckier indeed there's a weak radio signal detected in the mist um sensor sweep right hail the signal on comms take the shuttle down to investigate hail the signal on comms might have to make contact the old-fashioned way take the shuttle down right so you step off the shuttle across the ground settlement is about a kilometer off approach the settlement uh oh okay so the guards at the back hold weapons snug stat and domain fab kind of their clothing is hegemony crew survivors uh and they've been here for a long time from the looks of it the leader steps forward pulling off goggles did we win she asks uh the leader exchanges ah okay so it's a hegemony world making in the Perhaps their leader, an elder by the name of Er, called Commander, uh, follow. Cool. Uh, you pretend to sip a wretched yeast thing. Uh, coffee, uh, weapons, works to party. Uh, continue. Uh, you came from the Core Worlds, yes. We must get back to in contact with our proper chain of command. Protocols command it. Otherwise, continue catch up on the current history of the sector i would like to ask you some questions so i can't i can't do anything there what's this your fleet approaches <coughs> excuse me the sentinel gantries uh his Gemini's old work uh inspect the cargo storage area inspect the ship docks use the local facility to refuel oh is this another larry oh mean okay uh cool let's let's take let's take uh let's take barry's stuff and then also confirm was pretty much just stole from them but let's go and have a look so there's an ooh, cool there's another one of those and one of those okay so if i take that ship and even that ship they will heal themselves over time as i go along correct yes okay so this is a larry take facility to your feet awesome all right so that's gonna be that's gonna be good okay pause what else have we got in the system we've got a barren world out oh and that was the red dwarf down there well there's three suns in this system but there's nothing else so it's just a tundra uh which i would have loved to have done that can i get rid of them you guys tell me can i can i blow them out of the sky and have the tundra but or is it not worth it because there's only one in the whole entire system let's go down there and have a look but we've got a Larry, so we've got a backup. Not a Larry, a Barry. Uh, oh, what's here? Stop. Stop going so fast. Okay, stop. Hidden cash. Eradicator, first class. Ooh. Uh, Sundra, or a hound. Hidden cash. What does that go? Explore. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> Well, I don't want to engage those guys. Uh, sure. That's cool, but a little scary that it's a level eight AI with a automated battleship. Wow. Okay. Yeah. No, 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 I'm not touching you. Thank you. Uh, explore, attempt to open pod. Cool. Happy about that. What is this one? This is, uh, which one? Accelerated ammo feeder. I would be happy to spend a point on that. Recover leave awesome now let's get the sundra explore consider ship recovery sure gonna pick up some ships along the way right that's a little scary that thing uh begin salvage don't want the hound lovely all right let's have a quick look at this tundra planet perform a survey what have we got we have got 225 mm, no okie dokie let's go out this way so interesting that we've got uh we've got a, a cache there which is like teeming with ai uh cores uh controlled things and then we've got a tundra planet which has got hegemony uh hegemony people on it really like that tundra planet but that's right and then uh, yeah so we've got a couple of things that we can do Th that's a that's a cool start All right jump to space let's so we've we've had a look at this one un unsurveyed yeah because i didn't survey it this one here we need to go to this planet right let's 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 save 
just in case. We're still good on supplies at the moment. Oh, Nelly. Okay. Don't know what's happening there. Uh, what have we got here? We have got a jungle world. I'm, I'm always keen on a jungle world. Well, at least it's being repaired. <laughs> Who, who's repairing? Oh, it's this dude. Right. And then we've got that one. That one will come up nicely. Uh, what is it? An Eagle X4. Yeah, it's the same as that one. So that's that's cool. All right, let's have a look at this jungle world. Reformer survey. What have we got? Hazard rate. 100%. Cool. It's habitable. That's good. Uh, it's hot. Uh, mild climate. And the biosphere hazard rating. While the conditions are fantastic for biological scientists, surface technicians are hampered with strict. Okay, cool. Let's, let's just have a look anyway. What have you got? <gasps> Adequate farmlands. Okay, cool. This this is our this is our jam. All right. Can we Oh, we need a thousand. Okay. So what else have we got in the system? Let's let's pause. We've got three stable points. We don't have a jump gate. But I'm I'm close to the I'm close to the worlds. We have got a arid world. I don't know what an arid world is. Let's go and have a look. But that's cool. So we've got a jungle planet. Uh wait, why are you not going fast? Oh, and we're gonna run out of run out of fuel, by the way. Uh, not fuel, money. Need to go and try and get some money, sell some stuff. All right, what's this one? Performer survey. There is it's habitable, which is great. It's 175, so I'm I'm it's 25% over what I thought it might be. Let's perform the survey anyway. It has poor farmlands, but it has an abundant of rare, rare ores. And it has a moderate ore deposit. Okay, cool. Let's go back. So, not too bad. Like, it's only 25% over what I've been told that I should go for. So, that's that's all right. A lot of... Oh, that'll be why I'm running out of stuff. Uh, a lot of stuff to, to colonize it. But, yeah. And then three stable points. Okay, cool. Let's go to here. And let's try that other one while I still have, like I still have uh, supplies. Can't speak today. One of those things, just can't speak. <laughs> let's go and have a look at this one. Uh, oh, that one, let's save because that one is a red, a red world. So that means high danger. Yeah, cool. So it also means that it could be something really nice in there, like planets or anything like that jump into the system oh oh no 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 uh let's 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 not <laughs> let's jump in over here okay let's go here and we'll see if we can yeah possible sure salvage continue nothing right let's have a look so what have we got we have got a relay we've got one stable jump point we have got a rocky world, a barren world, and a barren bombarded world. Okay. Let, let's go and have a look anyway. Let's let's have a play around and see if we can find anything nice. If I get stuck, I can always re reload. Ah no 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 no! Okay, there was something there. Go go go! It just <laughs> was getting hit by a whole lot of stuff. Okay, go here. I just want to see what it looks like. That's that's horrible. Okay, leave. Leave now. What's over here? Okay, uh, pause, press six, access, likely to find something, continue. Not a lot. Right. Oh, so that is a battle cruiser. We'll give it a go. Like, let's let's see how we go. Like, it's going to be entertainment, but I I'm not holding out any thoughts because I've got these guys are not even ready at all. So I've got I've got three people. I'm gonna tell you to look after that, and then you to just carry on up here. It's it's gonna be horrible, but why not? <laughs> If I cut it out, I cut it out. Like somebody said to me, don't cut it out. But 
we shall um <laughs> if it's horrible content why put it in there okay let's have a look let's see if we can actually let's see if we can actually take out at least a couple of their ships all right go <laughs> i don't know if that's gonna work or not but go it wasn't really a fighting a fighting expedition oh my gosh eradicator look at you go you beast oh maybe i might have a chance i just got a high pitch there i'm very excited oh okay cool right what's next um what's the comms relay that's for faster recovery points let's go over this way Oh, no, no, no. Let's not go over that way. Let's attack this. I don't think you're going to be able to do that by yourself. I think you're going to die. <laughs> you're going to die. <laughs> yeah. Right. I had fun with that little dude at the start, though. Yeah, he's dying. So is he. And you're just coming late to the party, but that's all. So I can take out these little dudes. Don't know about this little dude. Well, I say little. He's huge. Rightio. Exit campaign. Let's go load the mission again. All right. Let's 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 not go in there. So we're here. Uh, the only other one that I haven't explored because uh, is that one. So let's quickly go up there. Yeah, sure. Like I need to spend more more supplies that's all good oh no no go back it's over here stop 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 i need you to go in there cool all right what's in here so if we it's a wolf class attempt open pod harvested organs take those and then there is a dram explore consider no begin salvage let's take all lovely what have we got in here we have got cryo world and a barren world Okay, let's have a look at this one first. And then we'll go up to the cryo world. Former survey. No. Okay, leave. And let's go up there. Oh, 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 oh. Two things. What is that? Striker class light destroyer. Striker. It's a striker class. Okay, well, just leave that one out because I think it's going to cost me too much. What's down here? Just a debris field. Okie dokie. Let's see what it's like. Nope. Nope. Okay, cool. Let's go up here. What is this one? Former survey. Oh, it's 225. Extreme cold. No. All right, let's get out of here. Let's go back to the core worlds and we're a little bit far out. Let's go to the hegemony one. Uh, right. Let's go in here and we shall definitely get some supplies and we shall sell some of this stuff. Get rid of the harvest harvested organs and those and those and that. And also that continue need some money. We might also get rid of this, 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 and this. Confirm. What did I just sell that was very expensive? 10. What did I just sell? High tech. Uh, that's torpedoes. Okay. You guys will probably tell me if I've done something wrong anyway. Uh, go like that. Confirm. Awesome, whole lot of stuff. 30,000 for that gas cannon, don't need those. Auto pulse laser, hmm, interesting. Don't need a whole lot of these, we'll sell a hundred of them. And then we shall buy that because I'm already in trouble. And also buy Banded Crew Deck. No. Oh, sort, confirm. Uh, we need some more supplies. Sure. 
and then we're still extremely extremely bad because because we are we we always go on the black market um right retrofit these dudes here so this one is good to go he has a lot of reaper class torpedoes on him which is ridiculous uh let's rip him of that and the heavy cannon and the light needler light assault gun he's got vulcans well he's got one uh vulcan and vulcan and a vulcan cool now do we have any rail guns we have one what about what about what about is it a heavy mortar oh no i'd have to have a look hold on where is it yeah no it's a heavy mauler heavy mauler right no heavy maulers uh hyper velocity there's one of those oh heavy mauler there we go lovely Got one of those and uh heavy mauler and then we're going uh hyper velocity somewhere there we go that one as well and i just don't have the rail guns well, that's okay uh let's shuffle those around so this one can come up here this one can go there not 100 percent sure about these two mm. retrofit what have you got you have got an auto pulse laser and some stuff what have you got you have got heavy cannon i'm just gonna i'm just gonna strip you out there we go and I'll probably probably sell you oh but you are uh x what does that mean i'm sure that means something yeah battle group ship survived the original 14th domain a battle group which found founded the hegemony it's a prime specimen uh increases armor with only an eight percent reduction in speed and mobility okay maybe i'll swap that out for one of the other ones and then this one not too sure well we'll keep them anyway right what have we got in here we got dedicated targeting core because i haven't got the integrated targeting core just yet go back 30 vents and probably let's go 25 of these now someone did tell me where is it uh, da, 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 da. shield conversion front uh where would that be under s for shield shield conversion front lovely and then now that go back that turns it into a uh, three arc 300 all right cool uh and hardened shields if i have it oh okay so esteban you're a legend uh you say you use one rail gun in the front two hyper velocity drivers and one heavy mauler okay so let's try that out with this one so let's say we've got a heavy mauler heavy mauler let's put one heavy mauler here and then let's put a hyper velocity there and another hyper velocity there we'll just leave it as is he has front shield conversions hardened shields which i don't think i have oh i do nice um bill and integrated targeting unit the two most expensive bills builds in doesn't have pds eagles and glimmers handle that uh outrange the enemies which is cool cool okay so let's drop this down and let's put in Harden shields and then let's put it all the way back up do, 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 do. nice all right let's play around with that because i don't have integrated targeting core just yet <sighs> right we're getting there people uh we're gonna call this one loki 
Hello. Okay, I. Loki. Because, you know, the other one's Thor. This one has to be Loki, doesn't it? Strike. Why didn't, it, why didn't it change it? Oh, there we are. And then this dude, he has got hyper velocity drivers on the front. And a mining blaster. Don't even don't mining blaster. Maybe an ion. What's this one? This is medium. And this is a small. Okay. Energy turret. So that's 600. Uh, point defense. 600. 800. Tactical laser. Phase lance. Perfect. 600. Mm. Mm. Uh, let's get rid of some of these and we'll try it out. Oh. What? Oh, there we go. Cool. And then we've got IR pulse laser, which is pulse laser. The IR one is 500. Very fast. So have we got IR pulse laser for that side? Yes, we have. We have got hammer class torpedoes. And we've got a mining laser and a PD laser. Let's put another PD laser there. And then maybe... Uh, let's drop that a little bit. Blast doors. Don't need blast doors. What's wrong with you? Uh, well, let's put an ion cannon at the front. Lovely. Right. So... Let's pump this up just a little bit because it's, it's got a lot to do with that. And then this one's going to be exactly the same. So let's auto fit. Let us save the variant. Current variant. Lovely. So let's go here. Let's go auto fit with my current variant. Confirm. Uh, the only thing that is different is IR pulse laser, IR pulse laser. Is that the same? Oh, yeah, cool. I just need these two changed out. But everything else is the same. Cool. Okay. Right. This guy I'm going to take back. This guy I'm going to take back. Right, people. Top speed. Why has he got bad? Oh, faulty power grid. Yeah. Uh, right. Let's have a look at map. Let's have a look at Intel. What have we got? Any bounties that are out there that I could potentially take on? Ooh, what are you? You have a griffin. You have a conquest. I've never seen one of those. Uh, you have a carrier ship. Mm, maybe not. Let's have a look. What have you got up there? What the heck? Eradicator. Uh, executor, sorry. Uh, standard battleship. Wow. Okay. Uh, maneuvering jets, uh, so Falcon, Falcon, we might be able to take on that one. Where are you? You're out there. Let's repair our ships. Yes. Let's have a look. Uh, no. Right, let's go back to Larry. Where is Larry? Sector. Larry is here. Let's go to Larry. And we will have a look at maybe a strategy on going up to uh, to attack that person. Cool. Jump. Go to Larry. Don't go into the sun! Damn it. What the hell? Okay. Go there. Okay, look. Let's stash our cargo. Oh, so many guns. Right, I'm going to put that there. I'm going to put that there as well. Going to put these two here because I was supposed to go and sell them. Haven't got around to that yet. Sort. And confirm. Right click on you. Awesome. So, sort. I could probably get rid of that alpha core if I really need money, which I really do. Uh, let's go fleet. So what we're going to do is we're going to store that one. I'm going to keep these two and keep these two. Keep that one. Keep this. Have a look at this one. Uh, and get rid of one of these. So none of these are the droids that I'm looking for. All right. Let's take the battle cruiser. Let's take that one. 
don't have enough crew, but I think I might somewhere. And let's put you up there. You there. You put you there. No, not there. There. Okay. And then we have got me in that one, because I'm lazy. And then you in here. Cool. You're a steady person. Lovely. Now, who's going to be in you? We need someone else who has got a lot of experience in ballistic. Energy weapons deal 30% more damage. So she's an energy lady. She looks very angry. But uh, ships charge, shields taken. Okay. Aggressive, not so much. Maybe the ballistic one could go in that one. And then in this one, we could go steady and this lady. Cool. And then this person could potentially have, oh, an aggressive pilot, really? <laughs> Let's put her in there. <laughs> and then put an aggressive pilot in here. Okay, should be sweet. Install you. Let's have a look at if we've got any crew. We do. Is that enough? It is not. Uh, we also need... I'm going to take these. Uh, confirm. Where is our closest hegemony area? Baron. Not hegemony. Tritachion. It's over there. So it is there. there. We're heading in the direction. We need to head in this direction. So let's maybe go here instead. Where is our intel for the bounty? It is here. Yep, we're heading in the right direction. All right, let's get it. Go. No, the sun. <laughs> yeah, Muppet. Ah, uh, who put a sun there? <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's go and sit. Wait, wait, wait. I haven't got the stuff. Oh yeah. Okay, let's go back into like the one that's not by the sun and then let's go to here pick up the stuff that i was supposed to buy i mean take I swear to god you're an idiot uh let's go here let's take the cargo uh that one and that one probably not going to sell you confirm Let's head out. Let's head out to that jump point. I've got no money. All right. Just saying. Don't point it out to me. I already know. People are going to rebel. Right. Let's go there. Go. Go, people, go. Don't get hurt along the way. What did I just say? Don't get hurt along the way. Okay, go, 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 in there. There, cool. Jump in. Where's Tritachion? There it is. I need the money. Quick, go. Of course you do. Okay, uh, there. Let's go to Station Commander. Turn in the AI cores. Lovely. This one's going to give me 30. This one's going to give me that. Perfect. Now, repair ships. Uh, let's get some petrol lovely and some of that and anything else heavy blaster reaper torpedo mm. no no okay let's get some more petrol here so should have enough to get out there and come back and i might get that as well cool sorted Oh, we do need some more crew. That'll do. Yeah. Yeah, cool. All right, repair. Uh, pause. Save. Got 700 supplies, so we should have enough to get out there and not cause any problems. Yes. Okay, so we're going to this person. This person is probably going to be my downfall for this episode, but... Uh, in the system with a dwarf primary star in the Spark constellation. 
What's a dwarf primary stat? Oh no. It's in the same area as that person. Oh, white dwarf. Let's let's have a look at that white dwarf first. That might be where we need to go. Alright, we are here. Let us jump in. Oh, that's always a good sign. So that means that there's something on the other side of this. Uh, let's do that. Aha, here we go. Move to engage. Right. Let's deploy these bad boys and go. Right, what are we going to do? This one is going to sit. Going to sit a, a marker here. So you are going to go up here. We'll sort out the rest of you when we get there. But that's where you need to sit anyway. Uh, not you. You you stay you stay back with this person. You're a little bit too eager. Okay, just just a wee bit. Okay, let's do this. We got it. We got it, people. We got it. Um. Right. So, uh, we're going to go you two there. Uh, we're going to have you guys here. Oh, come on. No, no, come back. Come back. Okay, I'm going to go you. I'm going to go you here. All right. You attack these. Awesome. So now we're going to say attack that one. Go! <laughs> Destroy! Destroy eradicators! Destroy! Nice, nice. Bum, 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 bum. You're going to die. You can just see it. But you're taking all the blunt of the stuff, so that's good. Uh, we are taking out an eagle, which is fine. Cool, cool, and keep going. Oh, the eradicators are doing good. What's that though? What are you doing? Are you actually doing anything? Come on, get in there. Oh, actually, you can attack that person. What are we doing over here? Is this being attacked? It is, which is good. Yeah. Yes! Awesome. Alright. Clear the rest. Do it. Take them out. <laughs> that thing nearly died, by the way, and so did that thing, but we did it. In the long run, we did it. Let's go here and press play. So, that is doing that. That is attacking that. This is coming over here. Cool. Go, go, go. Attack that one. We did it, people! We took out a ship, which I thought we couldn't do. Eradicators are cool, by the way. Very cool. Very cool. And that uh, that build of yours, Estevan, great. Great build. Awesome, awesome build. So, is that us? Yes, it is. Consider ship recovery. Oh, we can't recover the big dude. That sucks. Uh, so, we've got... An eagle. Nah, I don't need to recover any of those. Continue. Pick through the wreckage. Take it all. Lovely. We're going to go six. Access. Consider ship recovery. Oh, I thought I'd be able to get the next one, but no. Begin the salvage. Continue. Awesome. Right. We did it. We got 160,000. We repaired our ships with automated systems. Oh, we did really well. We did very, very well. Okay. Right, don't get cocky. Save. <laughs> All right, guys. Uh, I'm going to leave it here. I'm going to toddle on back to Larry, and I will have a look at some more eradicators. It's a barren world. What's in here? It's a barren world. No. Nah, cool. Yeah, I'm going to have a have a look around uh, here, and then I will toddle back to Larry, and I will fix up our ships, and we will. Do another episode for Monday. This one is Fridays. If you're watching this, I appreciate you. I love you heaps. 
and keep watching them because I love seeing you guys comments and I love playing this game. This game is awesome. Uh, Factorio is out on the weekend. I love playing that game as well. So two games that I love and yeah, you guys have a good rest of your day and I will see you in the next video. Bye.